Okay, so this week I've decided to do a week in the life of a mompreneur. So I run three businesses and I'm going to take you along what I do each week or what this week looks like. So today is Sunday. Sundays I usually do a, um, it's usually a work day for me. Um, it's the one day of the week that my husband has the baby and I'm able to just sit down for eight hours and work on my business. So today actually what it's looked like is <laughs> I took a two hour nap um and i had a call for um one of my coaching programs so i have um a coaching program and i had a call there now i'm about to do a call for a retreat so there's a beach retreat that i decided to well i didn't decide to do this but i was asked to speak at this event so i'm gonna do that and i'm doing it in my robe because <laughs> why not why not right it's really important that you understand the journey or the experience somebody has with your brand especially if you're using social media as the starting point for your marketing strategy come here come here, come here. Mm. okay so the work day is done i have finished um so i had what three different presentations today i still have quite a bit of work left to do sundays are usually my work day but um tay and i are currently like minimizing and we're getting rid of things we're getting rid of, of a lot of ah, ah, ah no 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 we're getting rid of a lot of um a lot of things in the house like i got rid of my sofa um i don't know if you guys knew i had a white sofa in here so we're getting rid of that and we're just getting rid of some other things i'm decluttering i'm getting rid of things that were inside of my closet so um yeah so the house is like a mess so <laughs> So we're gonna be doing that but then something in me tells me that I'm gonna do my hair so I had my hair out and I was like really excited about wearing my hair out but so um because of <laughs> so, <laughs> so um so oh you give a kiss you give a kiss okay can I have it can I have it <laughs> hey no no <laughs> y'all hey good morning so it's 11 20 and it's already been a pretty taxing well not taxing just like it's been an interesting morning so last night i stayed up until like 3 a.m doing my hair remember i said i was gonna like work um but i ended up staying up until 3 a.m doing my hair i did these box braids i did the jumbo box braids they were super cute but i just hated the way that it made my face look or what it like i wish i would have taken a picture so you could see um and then people would have probably been like oh look at it it looked nice but the braids looked fine there was nothing wrong with the braids i just didn't feel that great with them and so like i'm just going through this whole thing with me and my hair anyway right now um so you know it is what it is king Hillman, and then he wants my earrings so whatever um but okay so today is monday i on mondays mondays are usually content creation days for me so um whether it's for my own businesses <laughs> or for my clients today is the day i use for content creation but because yesterday um i had all those meetings well i had all those like different calls and stuff don't put that in your mouth no 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 thank you thank you so because I had all those calls and stuff yesterday, um, I didn't get a chance to do like a lot of the bulk work that I try to do each week. So um, instead, I'm going to do that stuff today. And that's going to be really interesting because I have King all day. So um, it's going to be interesting to figure out like how am I going to. Oh, good job. Thank you. You're going to put the earring on my ear. Earring for my ear. Hmm. So, um y'all see like we're trying to like move stuff so yeah um but anyway what was i saying so i literally just lost all what i was saying i have no idea what i was trying to say what was i saying hmm? okay i remember what i was saying so because i didn't get to do everything that i wanted to do yesterday in terms of just like getting ahead of all my clients work and stuff that's what i'm going to be doing throughout the day today but because i have king it may be like a little bit of a challenge um well not a little bit it's going to be a lot of bit of a challenge no sir no sir we do not put earrings in our mouth um thank you thank you um so it may it's, it's going to be a little bit of a challenge just making sure that things get done but what i'm planning to do is i'm just going to like do the stuff that they need for today and then tonight um usually at night i usually am able to take extra time 
So sitting down to do any like dedicated work is a no-go today. Um, ooh, I went to the bad light. Okay, it's a no-go for today. So <laughs> Or at least for right now until probably King goes down for his nap. So what's going to happen is, and I'm trying to like play this through because I have like kind of time deadlines for today. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to get as much done from my phone as possible, which I know I can probably put together like the post and everything because I usually have content already created, which I do coincidentally, which is great. So I'm going to post that kind of stuff for my phone and then I'll worry about scheduling and everything like that for my other social media clients later, like when he's down for a nap or when he's just sleep tonight um, because it's just increasingly hard to okay it's increasingly hard to do anything um, you know I try to sit like at the table or I'll try to sit on the sofa but today he's just not in the mood like he's not in the mood for to not be in my arms so we're dealing with that so I was just recently interviewed on black girls work podcast I'm super excited this is by my boo Ayana Hoskins and I'm so excited I'm listening to this and I'm just like dang I didn't even remember I said that like and it just makes me feel really good to be able to like share my full entrepreneurial journey to share like the fact that like I started out as you know a med school dropout and then I went into getting my <laughs> master's and now to think that I'm running three successful companies it's mind blowing, isn't it? It's mind blowing, huh? It's crazy. It's just so crazy. And I'm just really grateful. And I'm just sitting here listening to this episode like, wow, like, K, you did that. Between me and God. Oh, between me and God, like, whoo. It's been a journey. Okay, it's 3.15. King is taking a nap. My other child, Tay, is home. Um, while King is taking a nap, I am going to create content for one of my clients. And that's it, I think. I think I'm gonna call it a day after that. We'll see. But because it's not three o'clock and it's three fifteen, I really can't post. You can post if you want to. Uh, why do you say wait for five? Oh, I thought you were just not gonna post. You can post at three if you want to. Oh, okay. Yeah. Do you want to hear my post? Sure. Oh, man, that's all I wanted to ask you to do. What? Give me some hashtags. I need dirty. Now, can I get my hashtags? You said 30? <laughs> I'll give you 60 hashtags. <laughs> Just one of those days that I guess King is like needing a little bit of extra love. And so days like this are always hard because I am, I'm not behind on client work, but like I actually have some things that I need to finish. And so the hard part is like making sure that I give him his time while also making sure that I hit the deadlines that I know I need to hit. So I'm feeling like a little bit, I'm not overwhelmed anymore. I was overwhelmed like a few minutes ago, um, but I've just, I just finished with like the last thing that I absolutely needed to do. I have a call later tonight. Um, so for the retreat that I was doing, I'm doing a panel session with them tonight. Yeah, you know, it is what it is. That's Monday. Um, I don't know if I'm going to record any more today or if I'm going to save and just like record tomorrow because this might be a really long vlog if I actually post every little thing <laughs> that I do. But I'm just trying to share like all the work related stuff that I do. So I don't know. We'll see. So it is currently 9.52 and I am doing this panel now. Um, we're just doing like open Q&A. Well, it's kind of open Q&A. So they'll be asking questions to us on the panel and then we will be responding. I am the social media expert. I'm looking at the wrong place. I'm the social media expert, so I'll be talking all things social media and I'm super excited. Even though I have a ton that I need to do and should be doing, it's 11 o'clock. I'm gonna call it a night and I know I'm not even going to bed. I know I'm probably just gonna go in the room and watch freaking videos, but it's okay. This is only Monday, guys. <laughs> Woo mom life entrepreneur life it's so fun <laughs> happy tuesday yay say yay sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry kid so today is a very very chill day um i only have well today we have like a bunch of we because it's both of us right so um today we just have a bunch of like little trainings that we take part of so i'm in a mastermind um, i'm like a student in a mastermind 
and then um, I'm also in something else I forgot I just have two meetings today two calls that I'm getting on today just to learn um, which will be really fun and then tonight from six to seven I have a that beach retreat thing that I was doing last night I have one more part and that's today so it's just an hour from six to seven tonight so that's what we're gonna be doing I was gonna do content creation but your girl finna chill um, and I'm taking it easy today because King is like Mm, mm, mm. He wants all the snuggles, so we're gonna focus on that today. And then when he goes to bed, then I'll do some work. I didn't know I was taking a nap today, but I'm totally about to take a nap. Uh, Tay is actually coming up the steps with lunch, and then I'm about to hop onto this mastermind call. So I'm in a six month mastermind, super exciting. It's like a really good um, group of women, and today we're doing like a um, child trauma or childhood trauma, like uncovering your childhood trauma so that you can move forward in your life and in your business. So I'm super excited about that. Um, and we just do these like kind of workshops like twice a month, like we're doing another one this month. That's about, so we're doing another one this month all about um, hiring and stuff like that. So that's exciting. And yeah, I usually sit here and do it, especially because King be running around. So, you know, you know. Oh, say hi. Say hi. Okay, so that call lasted a little bit longer than it was supposed to, so I don't have as much time in between my calls. I literally have five minutes before I hop on this last call. So this last call, I am helping a group of women with content calendars. So for that beach retreat that I was doing, um, or that I'm like participating in, um, I offer to help people do 90 day calendars. So I am today, because like the times and everything were messed up today, we're spending one hour to work on their content calendars. Also, I broke my nail. Can you see that? I don't know. But anyway, the nail's broken and it kind of hurts. So that sucks. So tomorrow on the agenda is for me to go get my nails done at some point in the day. I don't know when I'm gonna go, but I have to figure that out. Good morning and happy Wednesday. So <laughs> what? What, what, what? I need a more stretch your face. Okay. Um, I'm up listening to the Goal Getter podcast. I was recently interviewed on this. This is a podcast by Candace. <laughs> Um, and it's just like a, a Candace and she's um, the owner or the CEO of Epic Fab Girl absolutely love that brand absolutely love her because she's like a beautiful woman of Christ who just really um, embodies a lot of Christian principles in building your business and so I just really love her and I'm so glad we were able to collaborate with this podcast um, and so we did an episode all about um, profitable content on social media so that was super fun um, <clears throat> and listening back to it I'm just like dang I forgot I said that like it's just so amazing how you can like literally forget you said something <laughs> but it's like so powerful and then when I heard it again I was like oh I needed to hear this today okay anyway so it's 11 15 um, I'm looking at my calendar right now there's not so Tay and I like we've merged our calendars um, and so it's so funny because I'm looking at today and it looks like it's a full day but it's all Tay stuff and I'm like I need to figure out how to like color code it so that I don't see Tay's calendar when I don't want to because it always feels really good to me to see that there's nothing on my calendar um, because usually my days are like powerful. so huh huh what's going on kid what's going on so, um, so yeah, I, um, I don't, I only have one thing today, which is a call at five o'clock with, um, with another business owner. Um, and it's really just, I wanted to know a little bit more about her business and to like, like get to know her a little bit more. So we have that call at five and that is it. So I'm really going to be spending today focused on, um, because remember I didn't work on Sunday, so I wasn't able to get ahead of like my work week as far as my client work. So, and then last night I told you I was going to work. Your girl did not work. I stayed up all night. I stayed up until like 2 o'clock in the morning watching Sisters on BET. Yeah, I know, I know. Um, but I'm all caught up. So, yeah. Okay. 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 Aw, oh, you gave them a kiss. Big boy, you gave them a kiss. So, today is going to be like a chill day. Hanging out with the kid. And just having like a good time. And, you know, doing like light tasks i may i'm really thinking that tonight <laughs> who knows i think i say this every night tonight i'm hoping that i'll stay up and work but who knows when the night comes sometimes i'll just be like you know what i'm just gonna watch tv yeah. and call it um and i mean like this is this is like the day-to-day -day life of 
an entrepreneur like I literally run three businesses I'm a photographer I'm a social media manager so I have an agency and then I'm also a coach so I do um, business and marketing coaching um, and so like but this is like my day-to-day -day life clean up clean up everybody clean up clean up clean up don't take stuff out clean stuff up clean clean no you don't put this in your mouth thank you high five high five no no high five okay high five mm. good job yeah high five for them yay high five kiss Mwah. kiss so I have a membership and right now um, I'm holding King and responding to a few um, questions and comments that are inside the membership. So I use Money Networks for my membership and I really love this platform to um, just create community and to have my audience, like have my members somewhere that's not a Facebook group. Um, I just find that Facebook groups can be like really overwhelming and people miss notifications. So having everybody's like stuff in one platform has been really, really helpful. In classic King fashion, as he was pulling out the things in my drawer, he found my old business card. So funny throwback <laughs> so i'm trying to go to the nail salon and king has officially hidden my shoes he has a knack for taking our shoes and hiding them so now i'm having to decide what shoes am i gonna wear okay tell you found a shoe for me thanks it's easier to wear flip-flops though because if i get my feet done Oh my gosh, I dropped the bag, y'all. So, or dropped the ball, that's what I meant, dropped the ball. I went to get my nails done, you know, and I forgot that I had the five o'clock, and coincidentally, I had a seven o'clock too, completely, I mean, the seven o'clock wasn't even on my calendar, so I'm not mad about that. But the five o'clock, I'm like, dang, like, I really wanted to talk to this girl, so we rescheduled, so that's okay. And tonight, I will be working because I just feel bad that I missed my calls without even, like, paying attention to what was going on which granted the seven o'clock call like that was not scheduled so that's okay but i just feel bad about missing the five o'clock because she's like a really cool like she's a really awesome entrepreneur and i really wanted to like learn more about her business and support her so um that will be rescheduled but yeah y'all i did like a little face treatment today i made like my own skincare products and so um i'm glistening honey oh 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 so yes it's currently almost eight o'clock so I'm just gonna hang out with King until he goes to bed. And then when he goes to sleep, mama is going to work, 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 work. <laughs> What's up? What it is, yo? I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, my best friend. It is 11.45, yes, I'm in my bonnet still. Um, well, of course it's, I'm gonna be in my bonnet, it's 11.30. So, um, it's 11.30, I am, like, I took a nap earlier, well, I didn't really take a nap, I just like fell asleep-ish on the sofa. Um, King is in bed, uh, and I now am going to, I'm gonna try to limit myself today to only doing two hours, so from 11.30 to 1.30. I'm gonna try to like, whatever's not done at 1.30, your girl gotta go to bed. I need to do better at going to sleep um, at a more reasonable time, which 1.30 may not sound reasonable, but it's actually super reasonable for me because I'm one of those people that, like I do my best, most productive work between 11 o'clock and like three in the morning. Um, but sometimes I'll like start working at 11 and then I won't go to sleep and like at all. Um, and you know, that's like not always the best thing in the world for me to do. And it's also like something that really just throws off my schedule. Okay, so it is 1.42. I am gonna call it a night, even though like my heart, y'all, I'm just like, I'm in it, I'm ready to go. But I'm just like, you know what? Go to bed, you need the rest. Okay, so it's like 11, what time is it? 11.30, um, <laughs> we are finally, what's up? Come on. We're finally up and we are dressed and King was watching Dinosaur Train. Now he wants the remote so he can change the channel, which is always a fun time. Um, so today we're just keeping it like pretty easy until this evening. I have two calls this evening. Um, I will be on them today. 
um they're definitely like they must happen one's at seven one is at eight so the seven o'clock one is me meeting with a bride and groom uh, well i hope the groom's gonna be there but their wedding is in two two weeks yeah two weeks from now um so and it's a two-day wedding so we're just gonna be like talking to nail down their timeline um and just make sure that i'm clear on how things work because they are a african couple so they're gonna be doing no actually they're a haitian couple i'm sorry they're haitian um and so they're gonna be doing a traditional like a traditional cultural wedding the first day and then the second day is gonna be like a traditional american white dress wedding um and so because of that i um i, I really want to I, I always with my brides but especially for them i really wanted to make sure that we nailed down so that i understood exactly like what images they need from their cultural wedding because i want to make sure that i capture like all the most important details i usually capture everything but it's just like you know you just like to make sure that you nail certain shots like if it's a shot that somebody really wants or if it's something that really like identifies or um just resonates with like their culture you just want i just want to make sure i capture those images so so my oldest child is home finally and he is currently starting his conference so it's a virtual conference um but he has like a couple of in-person breakouts that he's gonna go to so he just got home he fed the baby and put him down for a nap so now i am going to use this probably 30 minutes to an hour i'm thinking it's only gonna be about 30 minutes i'm gonna use this time to i'm redoing and revamping my product suite so because i'm doing that i want to like sit down and like dedicate time to do it that's pretty much it until my seven o'clock call today with my bride which i'm super excited about that's at seven and then i have my eight o'clock and that's it tomorrow i don't even think i'm gonna record tomorrow like i might end this vlog here today with thursday because tomorrow there's hold on let me look i'm just double checking so tomorrow there's literally like the stuff that you see on my calendar like this is all taste stuff there's nothing on my calendar for tomorrow and um fridays i like to take fridays like i don't take them off off but i do like half days on friday so i'm available to my clients but that's pretty much it so actually now that i'm thinking about it i think i'm going to close the vlog here with thursday or maybe i'll you know like close tomorrow i don't know anyway tomorrow is gonna be a free day we're gonna be chilling so i'm super excited yes so something new that I've been using is this um, website called Toggle and I've been using it to track the amount of time I spend working. I just literally started using this. So, um, but right now I'm mapping out my product suite. And so, so far this morning when I tried to like work on it briefly, I, it's not focusing, but I was only working on it for like six minutes and I'm about to continue the timer now. But I'm hoping that like, if, this will also help me know like if I'm spending as much time as I think I'm spending on things. So um, I'm super excited to like see what like what kind of time am I actually spending doing stuff in my business. So this will be super helpful just for the grand scheme of things so I know what, what I'm doing. So King woke up from his nap. So I had to come in here and put him back down and now I'm just gonna work from my phone or hope that Tay brings you my laptop sometime soon. So I'm waiting on my client for our Zoom but I wanted to show you how long it took me. So it ended up taking me a total of, can I click on this? I thought I would let you click on it. But anyway, it ended up taking me a total of 42 minutes to actually like do all of my, can, can I have this? Before? Okay, so it took me 42 minutes to finish <laughs> mapping out like all my stuff for my product suite. And here are like the little time blocks. So technically I worked on this like all day, like throughout the day. But I had four different time blocks that I sat down and worked. And so for the last one, which is the nap that King was taking, that was 29 minutes and that's when I actually finished. But then before then I worked for like five minutes and then six minutes. So that's really cool to know, um, like just how long that actually took me. Uh, and it also makes sense as to why, like I'm able to do this kind of stuff super fast with my clients. So that was super helpful to know. So me and the cool kid are gonna close the vlog out here. Um, I just have calls this evening. I have one call right now she's she said that she's hopping on in a second and then i have king hillman could you please it's okay um and then i have a group coaching call at eight which will be in an hour so that's pretty much all for today and then tomorrow like i'm literally i'm not taking tomorrow uh, completely off but i'm taking it off in terms of like i don't plan to do any like hardcore work it's i didn't Friday. get that could you Dang, try again siri mind your business king please don't call siri because she'd be tripping um 
so um what was i saying Oh yeah, so tomorrow I'm like gonna really just like keep it chill, like it's not gonna be a huge deal. We're supposed to be going to see the grandparents, so I'm gonna talk. <laughs> Benzie, chill. <laughs> chill, 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 bro. So I'm gonna take King to go see his grandparents tomorrow. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna start the weekend tomorrow. And then honestly, like uh, this is another thing I forgot to say, because I work on Sundays, Friday and Saturday is usually my weekend. So that's why I'm like off on Fridays-ish and whatever, because like I work on Sundays. So my work week is Sunday to Thursday. So this is a great way to end the vlog. Thank you guys so much for coming along with us this week. And I hope that you were able to like get a cool little sneak peek as to how like I am doing the things. Not all the things, but I'm doing some of the things and that's what matters. Bye boo, say see ya, say bye bye. Yay, good job.